We got it! We got the science ball head! Always be prepared to explain the house and the whys. Get one extra guess when hacking terminals! <laughs> oh my god! Bobby pins. More effective than lockpicks? Yes. <laughs> yes, they are. I'm sure. Just have to sit down. <laughs> Why not? Come on, Piper. Get up. You've got shit to do. There we go. Game face. Dino? What the fuck? Oh, my aim is so bad. <laughs> Ew. Hello? Oh! Oh, oh god, that's disgusting. Oh, see a door password? Was that to the door? Way back when? I don't know, Piper. Let's carry on. Oh, hello. Oh, jeez. Oh, really? There we go. Yes. Duct tape. Scalpel. Oh, that was worth it. Valentine! We did it! Oh. Alright, I'm on it. Oh, this must be the password to this. Hello, Freem. Um. Terminal, to open up this door. terminal. Ah, terminal. Alright. Ah, we got the password. That's fine. It worked! Hey! What is up with your eyes? Oh! Shut the fuck up, Valentine! Look what we got a speech bubble head! Oh my god! Perfect. Let your words be your weapon. All vendors apparently have a hundred more caps for bartering. Look at that! We only got a fucking bobblehead! Hell yeah! Interview. Holy shit balls! Valentine, you beautiful fuck! Where were you hiding that? Get hit in the head? I can relate. Hit in the head? No? Oh, just, just wait, okay? We're still... Oh my god, we got a bobblehead! <laughs> That's amazing! Alright, we're gonna chill. We're gonna look at this terminal. Welcome, employees. I'm already bored. Uh, oops. Alright. Huh. Oh. oh. Oh my god, that was exciting. Alright. Piper. Sure, just have a drink. Yeah, alright. Jesus Christ. Um. What are you? That's. Are you? Told you. I'm a detective. Look, I know the skin and the metal parts ain't comforting. But it's not important right now. Oh my god, look at the his hand. The only thing that matters is why you went to all this trouble to cut me loose. I'm looking for my baby. My little baby, baby Sean. His name's Sean. He was kidnapped. It's hard to take but seriously I don't know who in this took mask. Him or where they went. <laughs> Maybe I should try out another hat. Right Picked up lots of them now. Not the right place. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. Damn. She's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Alrighty. I can do that. We're going to try out one of these new hats. Because this gas mark is great and everything, but it's it's just it's not working for me. We need to show off a beautiful face. Military cap. What's this look like? Crew here used to be 
All right, that's that's pretty nice. What else we got? Um. Oh damn. Oh. Oh damn, that's nice. We're keeping those on. <laughs> you know what? Fuck that. <laughs> Skull bandana. Oh, we got different sunglasses. Oh no, I, I think I preferred the other ones. Um, I thought we had more than this. Maybe they're back home. Fedora. Oh, the fedora and the sunglasses, they look pretty nice. I think I like the military cap. Look, I know, look. Don't judge, okay? It's an important decision. Oh yeah, we look, we look fucking cool now. Alright. Oh, you swap chairs. Come on. Come on, get up. We're moving out. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, he's just standing here like, what the fuck is she doing? Let's go. He wants like his shit his pants. Maybe he was locked in there longer than we thought. But Piper? Tip. Oh, oh she, she comes. She's catching up. Don't. Valentine? Sorry, I didn't mean to kick a box. Are we taking him out? Nick. Let's keep moving. We'll talk once we're out. Uh, all right. Look, this is how we roll, okay? Oh well, fucking brilliant. Thank you, Valentine. We got him. Uh oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. There's there's no cover. Here we go. Uh hello? Oh! Oh yeah, butt shot. Beautiful butt shot. Is it? Oh, good job. Hard and loud. Doors on the Let me see if I can get it. I'm I'm not gonna say that's what she said. I say that far too much. But I mean, come on, you set that up perfectly for me, are. Piper. She's here. You missed the amazing. That's what she said. Joke. She doesn't care. Okay. Oh, oh wait, we're in. Nursery. Oh, jeez. Can we not go to the nursery? I mean, that's a bit. You know, I mean, I kind of lost my son. Hello? Oh, fuck! Jesus. Are you. you uh, I think he's fine. Jesus. I know his voice from somewhere. Who voices him? I'm gonna have to Google it. I'm sure I know his voice. Oh, fucking. Oh, Jesus. Jesus Christ, in fox. Another hey. locked door. Be too hard. Go for it. Requires key. Oh. Okay, I got it. But I hear big fat footsteps on the other side. Once we step through this door, get ready for anything. I'm ready. You ready, Piper? Piper's ready. Oh, I see, it's some proper. Okay. <laughs> that was really anticlimactic. <sighs> what are you doing? You're coming to my house and shoot up my guys? Do you have any idea how much this is? I have that dress. I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two timing game, Skinny. Not a television. I have your dress. Oh, poor little Valentine. A shame you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home to death. Shall I? Should have left that alone. This ain't the old I'm still so listening, I just there's things to loot. Oh I've been Oh fuck! Oh shit! Fuck off, bitch! You ain't got shit on me. Oh, oh jeez. Oh jeez, he's getting a bit fucked up. Yeah, these assholes don't have shit. Why would this guy Oh skinny man, he's gonna be a boss. Fuck off! Not 
Ellie. Your secretary, Ellie. Oh, look cool as fuck. <laughs> Mention something about your son, Sean. Meaning me. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. I think so. Uh, uh, I'll, I'll, meet, I'll meet you there. there. See you in Diamond City. Guess we'll just fast travel. <laughs> Completed! Yay! And we dinged! Fuck yes! Get the latest issue of Public Occurrences. Why is that a quest? Uh, sure. It's over here, isn't it? Telling people oh, hey. Busy work Net. Hey, sweetie. Hey, lady. That interview you did with Piper is really selling. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Thank you. Let's give it a read, shall we? Uh, misc. Aha. Uh -huh. Is that it? No, that's not it. View from the vault. Whenever I take a walk through Diamond City, there are so many things people tell me to be grateful for. Purified water, working lights, electricity, security. True, what we have would be would have been unthinkable even a few decades ago. But it's easy to forget that. Even after all the progress we have made, we are still living in the shadow of a world that was. A world before the threat of radiation, before the super mutant and the feral ghoul and the synth. So as fortune, so as fortune often has it, I cross paths with Kamiko Kit, Vault Dweller, a person who is experiencing the Commonwealth for the first time. Cool. Alrighty. Um, what are we doing? Oh yeah, Valentine. Right. <laughs> so we got distracted. You are two hundred years old. Pretty good for your age, huh? Mm, why thank you. You there! You need a genuine, authentic, custom made hickory swatter. Um. What's what? a swatter? <laughs> Rookie, eh? The swatter, my friend, is a Diamond City tradition. See, <clears throat> it used to be that this whole place was a stadium. And no two shit. teams would meet and play a game called baseball. One team would beat the other team to death with these things called baseball bats, and, and the best bats were called swatters. True fact. Um, that's hey, not dumbass, baseball. That's not how baseball was played. <laughs> that right, little Miss Smarty Pants? If you're such an expert, how do you think it was played? More violent. Yeah. Oh God, it's really you. Oh, I want to scare. It's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. You keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. You're welcome. Pay me. <laughs> Metal detective delivery. At your service. Happy to be in a niche <laughs> market, that's for sure. Here. Every cap we agreed to for finding him. Plus a little something extra. See, no. I don't need to be rude. 125, nice. On the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. Alright, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Wait! Oh. Sorry. I kind of made a mess. You got lots of new teddy bears, though. Oh. My. God. Piper. We look. Fan-fucking-tastic. <laughs> we look so cool. I'm ready. Oh, oh, oh. Alright. When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Me, me, me. everything you can. No matter how painful it might be. Um... Describe the My murder. husband was murdered. He was just trying to keep them from taking Sean, and they. They just. They just. It's okay. You don't need to say anything more. So, we're talking about a group of cold hearted killers. They 
waited until something went wrong to resort to violence. What else can you tell me? We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. A lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. Anything else you remember? There was a man and a woman. They didn't say much, but but I remember they they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team, professionals, the kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup means, though. Anything else you remember? We're looking for my baby, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care. The baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the gunners. And of course, there's the Institute. So, you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. If something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer <coughs> models, good as human, infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, where they are. Not even me. I'm a synth myself. It's got a prototype anyway. Oh, I see. You're a prototype? As far as I know. Never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal. And there's the newer ones that are almost human. I'm somewhere in between. Either way. I need to find Sean. Right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? Um. The woman was dressed in, uh... I think it was kind of a hazard suit. The man had... Some sort of metal brace on his arm. Maybe some kind of improvised armor? A lot of iron guns do that to look tough. The hazard suit is interesting. Not many mercs can afford something that fancy. What else do you remember about it? I'll never forget that voice. Low and rough. Like... Like sandpaper. Across your face. Uh -huh. Not much to go on, but a tough and commanding voice can get someone pretty far in the violence business. What else? One of them came right up to me. Bald head, scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. <coughs> you didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Kellogg's? Like the cereal? Who is he? Do you think he has Sean? <laughs> Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. He bought a house here in mm. town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned wet stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. What? It's Sean. It's not Sean. Could it be? No, it can't be Sean. Um. Maybe it's another kidnapped kid. Yeah, either that or he's got a son of his own. Not a comforting thought in any case. Both of them vanished a while ago. Haven't been heard or seen since. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. 
Alrighty, follow Nick. I'm ready. We look fantastic. We're oh Jesus. Look, I've said this to Piper. Personal space, okay? Jesus, Piper, you coming? Get your game face on. It's time to go. 